goat ad lib. Oh, mama, that's your number one go to. Mm -hmm. Is that for your mom? You just mama. Is so is that for your mom? What's your goat ad lib? That answer the question. I love my mama. So that's mama. for your mom. That's for my mom. That's so nice. What's the story behind the mama ad lib? The story behind the mama ad lib is she used to chase us up and down the house. <laughs> Trying to whoop us, and we make sure we call her name and say, I'm just playing, mama, I'm just playing. And when she gets to you, say, mama, 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 mama. And that's how I Remember came. Oscar Proud and Proud Family? And exactly. he go, mama! Exactly. Only when you're in trouble, you call her name like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, my go ad lib. What is my go ad lib? I just say. Sing? Yeah. They got tons of ad libs. I just say, yeah. Yeah. Or oh. How you say it? I sing it. Yeah, yeah. Ooh. Like that. Hard. That's hard. <laughs> it's Bryce Davis on the check-in, and we got Quavo from the Migos, or formerly known as the Migos, if they're still around, not quite sure. You know, they said they split up, but you know, we'll see in the future. But anyway, he's on the GOAT talk with Chloe Bailey, you know, as part of Complex's show, where he talks about his most infamous mama ad-lib, you know, that he does on a lot of his songs. And you know, with his explanation, it makes sense, because if you, ever paid attention to the tone that he says mama see i can't even do it but you know he does it on a lot of songs and it makes sense with the story that he just gave and whatnot now me personally my favorite ad lib is i can't even say it you know definitely gonna get demonetized for it but anyway anytime somebody says like a b word or a p word it just hits every time like you have rappers that be like yeah or okay or facts you know they'll say that as an ad lib sometimes it can be hit or miss but i swear anytime somebody just cusses the b word or the p word it just hit every time you know i'm yet to hear it not hit you know what i mean but that's just my personal favorite ad libs you know everybody can have their own i personally feel like ad libs got popular once uh Dipset came out, you know, Cam, Jim, and Joels was using them heavy, but Jeezy really brought it to the mainstream as far as, in my opinion, you know, like heavy, ad heavy ad-libs, you know, on every song kind of thing. So between Jeezy and Dipset, they definitely was on top of it when it comes to ad-libs. So let me know y'all's favorite ad-libs in the comments. And of course, if you like the video, make sure you like and subscribe.